Welcome to another video. I am the Starman and I am here in the lockdown garden. It's pretty cold. Can you see my breath? Yeah, it's uh, yeah, it's pretty cold. And if I just pan, this is a bit of a quick one, by the way. If I just pan up here, where is it? Where, can you see that there? <laughs> We've got a nice bright moon in the sky, and it's actually a waxing gibbous moon. Now that means that it's getting brighter, it's heading towards a full moon and I think tonight it's about 80%, maybe a bit more than that, I'm not sure, but it's heading towards a full moon and they call it a waxing gibbous. Anything past a half moon on the way to full is called waxing and when it goes past the full moon it then starts to wane, so then it goes into a waning gibbous phase on the way to a last quarter moon and after that it turns into a waning crescent and then it goes back to a new moon where you can't see it because it passes in front of the sun. Yeah so anyway I thought I'd just come out into the garden and just tell you a little bit about what you can see when the moon is like this um, and when it's cold as well. You can see amazing moon halos. Yes I saw some um, just before Christmas. I missed one this week. I was really disappointed I missed one this week. Um, so it's always worth keeping an eye out for the moon. Um, I'm just going to show you a picture on, on the screen now that I took back in December uh, from the garden. I took a picture of the moon. They're very easy to take a picture of. You can take a picture of them with your mobile phone. Look at that there with the tree behind. Absolutely amazing moon halo. Now what I did after that was I thought, right, um, I want to go to the promenade and see if I can get it with Black Pool Tower. Well, check this out. As you can see, I got to the promenade. And unfortunately, it had faded a little bit, but you can see there, I did manage to just about capture the moon halo and Blackpool Tower as well. Just about fit it in my 24 millimeter lens. It's quite big. It's a 22 degree circle that goes around the moon. And you see the same thing around the sun during the day. If you get a certain kind of cloud, a very high cirrus cloud if you look out if you keep looking at the sun during the day you never know when there's cloud around you can they're fairly common you know they are fairly common uh, they're not rare um, i would say moon halos are a bit less common because um, um the moon does have to be fairly bright and um you know and and it needs to be cold pretty cold it's cold now yeah you need just to so watch out if you ever get foggy conditions freezing fog anything like that and we have a nice bright moon like we have tonight here where is it there it is there a waxing gibbous moon that is ideal for capturing amazing moon halos now i'm going to be watching out for some of these moon halos this this winter i'm going to keep my eye out tonight because you never know in fact what's that up there someone's got a drone can you see that? There's a drone up there above my house. Uh, I'm going to turn the camera around. Check this out. There is a drone. So there's a the moon. Sorry about the reflection. That's not a planet, by the way. <laughs> and there is a drone. Right above my house. How weird. I wonder what the hell that was. Look at it, it's moving over there now, look. By the way, that little orb there is just a reflection of my phone. It's my iPhone. It's got this really bad. I wonder if they're trying to get close to the moon with the drone. What do you think? Anyway, how weird is that? How about that? Uh, I've never seen a drone flying above my house before. Um, I wonder what they're... Uh, wonder it's still there. Yeah, it's still there. I wonder if it's the uh, the police checking for people, you know, breaking the rules on the virus. <laughs> Who knows? Anyway, um, I'm going to leave it there. Uh, the drone's still there, still surveying, probably looking for naughty people out in groups. Uh, so anyway, look out for moon halos, spectacular moon halos. As you can see, I've managed to capture some already this winter. So look out for when the moon is nice and bright and when it's... Uh, very very cold and you get like a freezing fog 
and you might just be able to see a moon halo there absolutely spectacular i'm sure you can agree from looking at my photographs anyway if you like the video hit the like button and also hit subscribe and tick the bell for notifications of new videos and i will see you again next time Thank you.